and good evening from Russia. So we're in, uh, to, uh, uh, nine hours really, we're at the border in total. Um, so we got going, done about 40 minutes so far. It's quarter to 10 local time, still nice and sunny. We're gonna uh, get to a couple of hours outside of Moscow, all going well in this hip, drive through the night and hopefully the road works that we've heard about, uh, which I think are the same ones from January, hopefully they're not too bad and they won't cause us too much of a hold up and fingers crossed with it being night time, there won't be too much traffic about as well because it's sometimes easier to drive on the other side of the road where it's possibly smoother, although not by a great deal, if I'm brutally honest. But generally this road isn't too bad, um, just have to see how it goes and hopefully I'll film a couple of interesting bits and pieces. If we see them, and if the light is still good, I'm guessing it's not going to get dark for particularly long, to be honest. Because we're quite sort of far north at this at this point. We're going to sort of drop southbound a little bit, and then just sort of head east. So it will get dark, but probably not for some time. So I'm going to sit back and enjoy the uh, scenery, in inverted commas. And excuse the hay fever as well, I realise... Uh, putting this video, these videos together, that one, I say err a lot, which is really quite frustrating, and that I've been sniffing quite a lot because I've got a bit of hay fever for the first time in some time, so I do apologise up front for all of that. Well, I know it's the night time, uh, I thought that I didn't think this would be quite as bad, but I don't know if this is the same stretch exactly as what it was in January, but <laughs> we've done one kilometre on here so far, and unfortunately, it's January time, there was 60 kilometres worth of this, so I just hope it's not quite as bad tonight. Rudy day but it was 60k in January. At least there's some solid surface this time, last time it was just mud. Twenty to three local time in the morning. It's not the afternoon, is it? Not <laughs> not this dark. Keeps you on your toes, at least, I suppose. There's a very quick bit that's been resurfaced and uh, we're now about to drop back onto uh, here we go again so <laughs> this is now kilometre 90 that's nine zero of this uh, stretch of roadworks. 
to be fair, there has been a bit of tarmac. We did have, uh, I don't know, maybe 30k, something like that. But it's all been resurfaced and done and sorted. And then all of a sudden we're back to this. And it's just a nightmare. Thankfully we're not doing this during the day because I can imagine it's just bedlam. I don't, I don't really don't know why they can't maybe just do 50 kilometers at a time, rip it all up and resurface it rather than just rip the entire length of the road up and just leave it. It's just <coughs> sort of make any progress. <laughs> this poor old Chris behind me. I reckon his throat's going to be dry. The amount of dust and crap that's being thrown up. <laughs> There's just no end in sight of this lot. It's just... <laughs> I thought it was bad in January when we came through, but this is a lot, lot further than what that that is, or was, and uh, we've not even seen the shell garage yet, which is where we're sort of aiming for to stop and get a splash of fuel. We should have uh, been about an hour from the parking where we're hopefully going to park up for now and Get a bit of smoothness well before the other trucks turn up. I'll just put the dive back over, mate. Pressed to believe this is actually a motorway. This is the M9 main motorway to Moscow from Latvia. <laughs> oh. Still, I suppose at least once it's done, it's going to be done. The most depressing part is we've got to come all the way back down here as well, whenever it is soon. There's a broken down truck here, so uh, just got to <laughs> try and get round him. Yeah, it's a little bit soft through there.
just hit the 100 kilometre mark Ugh, of roadworks. Had a little bit of tarmac back there where it all got a bit quicker, but uh, now we're back down to this rubbish. So, uh, fingers crossed, we're almost out of it. I did say that earlier, but. <laughs> Madness, absolute madness. But at least you can get a little bit more speed up on here, unlike back there where we're the best part of walking pace, really, because it was just so rough. It's just a little bit soft. <laughs> well, I don't know, I wouldn't have thought it was particularly safe. <laughs> we're going to find out now because truck's coming. Sort of try and just force them to, to get over. That might might work to your advantage. So if that is definitely it, which by the look of it it is, that has been 112 kilometres of roadworks. <laughs> you think your day was bad? Try doing that. <laughs> Bloody Nora. Can you imagine if any council in England even attempted to put 100 kilometres of, cute, of uh, cones down a motorway? God. <laughs> It'll be anarchy. Right, let's try and get some bloody miles done then. <laughs> 